Hi everyone, welcome to Design School MC. In this video, I will create coffee icon design. Okay, first select a lip tool over here, or you can press L on your key and create object like this. Okay, remove this stroke color and change the fill color using brown color. Scroll over here and a little bit down over here and click OK. Zoom in. And duplicate this object, paste in front, and change the size a little bit small, and put over here, and change the size a little bit bigger, like that, and move on the right, like this, okay, and select this object, and go to Pathfinder, and click minus one. Okay, that looks good. And select the pencil over here. And click here. Click here. Click here and scroll like that. And click over here. Scroll like that. Maybe I will remove this line. Click over here. Scroll going up. And click here, scroll like that, and click here. Click this point, and click here, scroll like that, 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 click this point, click here, scroll like that. And close this point and scroll like that. Maybe I need to edit this line. Click this point and scroll like this. And move this point a little bit on the lip. Okay, like this. I think this looks good. And I will edit this line. Okay. In this point, scroll a little bit going up. And this point, scroll a little bit on the right, okay, like this, and remove this draw color and copy this brown color. Double click on the fill, maybe I will change the color over here. This is my color code, I will copy this code, click OK, and select this object, double click on the fill, and paste the color code over here, click OK. I will change this object a little bit small, okay, like that, and I will adjust the point, the line, to make the shape looks good. A little bit going down, and this a little bit down, a little bit going up, and this I will adjust the line like this. Maybe I need to edit this line like this. You can follow me. Or you can create your own line. This just for tutorial. You can create another coffee shape using same technique. Okay, like this. And I will put this object on over here. A little bit maybe a little bit down. Okay, like this. Uh, zoom out. Okay, that looks good, and I will select the pencil over here, uh, maybe ellipse tool, and create object like this. Okay, like that, and duplicate this object, go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front, change the size a little bit small, put this object over here, okay, over here, maybe a little bit down. And select this object, go to Pathfinder and click Manage Run. Okay, and put this object over here. Okay, over here. And zoom out. Maybe I need to change this size a little bit small. Maybe like this. Okay, and I will cut this uh, line. 
like this create object like this close this point select this line go to perfender and click minus front okay that looks good maybe a little bit going up and i will duplicate this object go to edit select copy edit pitch in front a little bit down and change the size a little bit small maybe like this and a little bit down click this point and scroll on the right in this point too like this okay and i will create object using ellipse tool like this and put this object over here to cut this object maybe a little bit going up and select this object go to port finder and click minus run okay i think that looks good maybe i will zoom in i will edit this point uh select direct selection tool over here and click this point and scroll like this click this point and edit this point the position a little bit going up like that and in this point too like this scroll a little bit going up click this point and scroll a little bit down and this point too a little bit down zoom out okay i think that looks good maybe i will group this all object right click select group and i will put this coffee on the center like that okay i think that looks good okay guys i hope you learned something in this video and if you happy with my video tutorial don't forget to click like share and subscribe my youtube channel to get new video tutorial every i'm update new video and if you have a question you can leave a comment below and you can go to my youtube channel in design school mc and watch more video tutorial and see you on the next video